Greetings YouTube, I'm making another video, I'll try to make it quick. I'm not going to read it this time, I'm going to put the link below if you want to read it yourself. I'll just give you a quick synopsis that will be at least 20 minutes long, so stay tuned. I'm just kidding there, trying to uh, break the ice as it were. Anyway, autograph alert slash news dot html is direct link to this page if you're interested. October 11, 2010. Now, th this post today, um, like I saw today on a forum, somebody asked, is JSA uh, authentication any good? And as I always tell people, as I've shown in videos prior to this one, as I'm showing again in this video, they are not any good. And there's still people who trust them. And they're like, here, James Spence can't, still can't tell a printed signature from real ink. This item recently appeared on eBay, eBay item number 3504756306609. It's an Andre the Giant autograph photo. JSA selling price was $24.99. This particular photograph was authenticated by James Spence. There's the authentication. There's a date and a number. And uh, they say it's real signature, but that is a, a pre. That's a copy of a picture with a signature on it. That's printed on the. That's part of the picture. That is not a signed picture, but JSA can't tell the difference. Um. That's why a lot of scammers are using JSA now. Everything they send to them gets authenticated. Even bogus pictures like this one get a, a regular, you know, couple dollar picture. Costs one or two dollars depending on where you had it printed. I mean, you could buy these at, you know, hobby shows and stuff like that for five bucks. Is, you know, usually the going price for them. And that's the retail price. I mean, you could buy this picture yourself with the exact same autograph, and who knows, maybe you could send it to JSA too and get it authenticated as real. And this particular seller on eBay, Game Cards and Games out of Plainsville, Ohio, sells lots of junk like this, and he sells it. Sold, that is, no returns. Which is quite odd for autographed uh, sellers that usually accept returns. But this seller obviously knows it's fake, even though it has a COA. Like I said, scammers use JSA to authenticate all their stuff, just like they used to use GAI before GAI went out of business. Don't forget, check out autographalert.com, autographalert.com slash news dot HTML. The link will be below if you want to go straight to this page. Dream big, thanks for watching. Please share this with other people in the community. We gotta get the word out. Forces of evil and a bozo nightmare. Ban all the music with a phony gas chamber. Cause one's got a weasel and others got a flag. One's on the pole, shove the other in the bag with